we have 1 through 28. Man. It's all right. And so if it's a 1, it's going to be Cleveland. If it's a 2, it's Tampa Bay. It's basically reverse order of what we drafted. The highest valued team has the most highest number, would be San Francisco. The least valued team has the lowest number, Cleveland. And then once a certain team has been selected, before the next roll, I'm going to take out all of those same player teams. And then re-roll for who gets, you know, the next one in that in that region until we decide, you know, which team is in each region. So we'll just keep changing how many how many dice or you know how many options there are on the die and taking away the options as we go. Oh man, I wonder what happens if I move that change it that did change it pretty wild no 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 not you What a pain. Does that make it look right? Now we'll have to make sure it stays there. All right. So uh, without further ado, let's get this shit started. All right, so let's see who's going to get the number one seed in the low-end theory bracket region. Dice parser earlier. What did it say? What'd you say, dice parser? Here we go. One D. One D. One D. Twenty-eight. Lucky person is. Woo! Number twenty-eight. Wow. San Francisco. 
coming up strong. Okay, so let's take out all of Joey's teams. Well, his are pretty easy because you can just... over them. So that leaves 24 teams. All of Joe's teams are out of the mix. I'm going to use this order. So, <clears throat> sorry about this, uh, for the two seed in the low end theory bracket, low, no, the low, oh, I failed on that one, low white end theory region, I have to go back and change that, just called it low end, what the fuck? That's terrible. That need, that deserves immediate attention. All right. One die. Twenty four. Number eighteen. Washington. Oh, yeah, and I had a way of revealing it on the stream. Let's go. Let's go. So, let's see. The one seed. There they are. The two seed. who just got some there they are I mean there they are next up the three seed so let's tidy this up so that's all the DTs oh these doubles are making this really easy the first time through which is nice bye bye Washington Bye bye Miami. All right, one through twenty. Here for the number three seed in low white. Twenty 
20 of them. Hits the 20. Manyo with the Giants. The three seed. Is Gigantes. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and get that one on there. Mm, excuse me. Los G. That's right. I forgot the double G's. Yeah, let's make that visible. All right, now the four seed. Let's take care of all of all of Zimanios. Doesn't do that. Man, Manuels had the doubles too. This is crazy. I mean, I guess it's because of who got erased out. That makes it so much easier. All right, down to 16. This is for the four seed. One die, 16. That's two out of three. That was the highest number. Number two. Tick. And the Falcons. Okay. Tick, 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 tick. All right. Um, let's see. For the number five seed. In the low white. Down to 12. Wait, no, I gotta erase all the ticks. The politics. I mean, I guess it's just like. The nature in me just want to make that shit just go away. All right, tick, 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 tick. Uno mas. Should get us down to twelve. All right, for the five C to play tick and then play Joey. Yeah, I almost think that getting the one seed is a little bit of a double-edged sword. I mean, it's it's nice to have that buy, but you also want to play. I don't know. I don't want to play as much as possible. So this one is 12. 1D12. Number three. Who's number three here? Oh, not that one. Me. And the Patriots. <laughs> Very nice. Three is a magic number. Camp and the Pats. It's me. It's Pat. All right. It is pretty juicy. Oh. Be honest. Digging it. Okay. Uh, now for number six. This is to face Manos Gigantes. And remember that in each of these, we are getting to two. Uh, 
um, two two teams coming out of each region. So it's double elimination, but top two teams are going to move on to the Elite Eight. All right, so let's go to number six. In the honor of playing I'm going to get rid of all mine. At least there's a couple doubles. That's nice. A double double. So this is basically between Stew and Grip. One through eight. Number three. That is Grip. Packers. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> um, let's see, six. The pack attack. And let's go to the last one. Which one of Stu's teams? It's going to be Philly, San Diego, Pitt, or Chicago that are playing. Who are they playing? DT and the Redskins. So Stu's playing DT. Which team? DT, which team are you feeling of Philly, San Diego, Pitt, or Chicago as the best matchup for your Redskins? Philly is Philly did really well in this format unexpectedly. Like they fell, they dropped all the way down. And because of the weird quirk of having uh, their quarterback stolen and then that quarterback stolen took away less te less uh, less players away from their team. And ended up having them still be, be pretty solid. I mean, you got Bo Jackson, Troy Aikman, and the Washington, or no, the, which O-line was it? The Miami O-line. <laughs> Not Philly. Oh, let's, let's find out. Number three, a lot, a lot of number threes. Pittsburgh. Interesting. I don't think they got a quarterback. Did they get a? Oh no, maybe they got. Did they get quarterback bills? Help me out there. I don't want to change. But that is Stu and the Steelers. <clears throat> All right. That is the low end, low white end theory. Whew. One of these times that's going to be it. 
and now all of these teams are out as well as if it lands on a certain if it lands on Joey's for the first seed it won't count in this next one so let's see did I change this one yet I did let's get a quick pick of this Pretty gangster. All right. Low white and theory bracket. Awesome. All right, let's do the next one. On to the next. And this one's going to be Fuck did I did I pin this too? I did. Fear of a quarterback Browns planet. I really love this one. I'm going to have to like Tag like, ooh, that's too big. Let's do it on quarterback Browns. Yeah, we'll keep that. All right. Now this is for fear of a quarterback Browns planet. And in this case, let's see, we have to take out those teams that won. Wow, these bottom two. So we're gonna keep the same Washington, there's another, um, Steelers, Packers, it should be down to 21, right, who's left, Falcons, Patriots, is that it? Yeah, and that'll leave us at 21. Okay. Oh, no, it was, a, it was a Eagles, right? No Eagles. Falcons. Patriots, yep. What are you doing? acting all dumb and stuff. Okay. He said he didn't want to play the Eagles. All right, so 1 through 21. This is for the one seed in Fear of a Quarterback Browns Planet. Who's going to get the one seed? Let's find out. Number two. Manio in Tampa Bay. Very nice. All right, let's get them up in there. The 
Buccaneers with the one seed. Yeah, I think this was a better way to do it. Make the one seed kind of be on there for a while. Let it be known as we move to number two. So if that would have been Joey, I would have just re-rolled one through 21. And that's the process I'm going to take going forward. So the next time, if it rolls Joey or either Joe, <laughs> Manio or, or Joey B, uh, I'll just re-roll. So there's no sense erasing them when I have to use them again in the next next roll. So um, let's see. Manios is out. So all of Manios teams. So that should be three of them. I guess we're just going to go down in threes. One. Two. Three. All right, so down to 18. All right, um, now for the two seed, 1D18, number four, that's DT in Seattle. Okay. Get that up on the chart. See hogs. And for the number three, the rice shredder. That's right. Jay Schrader. Shakey's Pizza. All right, let's see. Uh, now for the number three seed in in fear. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna Joey gets it for time's sake. So I get rid of DT's teams. Here's a nice double. Sweet, sweet. And 15. Math checks out. 1D15. 10. The Rams. Ho <laughs> <laughs> oh man <laughs> that is a heavy hitter let's see okay now yeah no the six seed is not what you want um, let's see, four and five next, the next two are, the winner is who faces Manuel's Bucks, so, yes, hey, quarterback Browns is in this bitch, that's perfect, <laughs> Nice call. He's the Rams quarterback. In uh, what I had caught, deemed earlier as the power play move of the draft. Uh, exchanging Jim Everett for Vinny Testaverde, quarterback Browns. 
or not Vinny Testaverde, um, for Bernie Kosar, quarterback Browns, ensuring that the receiving talent he has has an elite PC maker. <laughs> I like that, PC maker. All right, um, let's see. So, number four, who's going to who's gonna play each other to face Manio's uh, Buccaneers? So, did I take out... Nope, got to take out Grips Teams. Teams, Raiders. He's got a full-on Battle of L.A. situation himself. All right, now we're down to 12. Let's see. 1D12. Number 1, numero uno, the Cleveland Browns. Quarterback Eagles and quarterback Browns in the same bracket. Who would have thunk it? I'm still holding out hope for, uh, yeah, for Philly. Get Troy Aikman as the Eagles quarterback up in there. All right, who did I just roll? Number one, Joey B. Stream. I did not. Let's do this shit. Browns. Who's going to be number five? Twelve. Nope, I didn't need to erase this shit. Don't go too fast, man. You don't want to go too crazy. All right, nine. Here we go. One D nine. Number four. Stu and the Chargers. Ooh. I, they're. I think, if I recall correctly, they're pretty uh, offense challenged, but that defense is no joke. So no Troy Aikman. Who who's gonna face the Rams? About to find out. Who is this? Is not the Chargers. All right. So eliminates Stu. And we're down to six. Is it going to be Camp or Tick to have to face Grip and his Rams? What's it going to be? Yeah, there isn't a, a heavy hitter in here, really. The silence of the Rams? Or is it going to be a deafening, silencing roar? What are we down to eight? Six. All right. So four. So Stu versus Joe. Now the for the sixth seed, playing Grips Rams. Six seed, and this is number six. I wonder if it's going to be a six. That would be wild. The way this, this draft has been going, I would not be surprised. 
do got it to six, right? Yep. Just don't want to fuck this up. Okay. Number one. Oh, 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 oh the Cowboys. Oh, my. Okay. Okay. That always seems to fucking happen. Big one early versus grit. Earlier on, it was a Cincy and uh, Miami game. And then it kind of devolved into Patriots, Colts all the time. Whew. That's, that's, a, that's a wowzer. All right. So which of Tick's teams... Is going to face, was it DT? Then the Seahawks, okay. Whew. Yeah. <laughs> well, here we go. Okay. Let's get this. It's crazy. Yeah, that is I I, I that's a, I think that's a fun matchup and it's a divisional rivalry. Fear of a quarterback Browns planet. I like it. Interesting bracket. Uh, let's see. Let me get this. Let me just get this right here. Okay, got that saved. <laughs> All right, let's see. Uh, next bracket. So I got that. So next bracket, we got. Baby got back and bead. <laughs> Let's see how many back and bead teams fall in here. <laughs> like it. Okay, let's see. I like it. 
<laughs> All right, uh, let's get started. Yep, Houston. Some Grogan. Some 4K. All right, well, let's get this shit started, too. So, we're going to have... Let's see. Let's get rid of all the teams. Skins were taken. The Rams. Chiefs. Should have went up twice. Let's see. Chargers. Packers. Cowboys. And the last two. Buccaneers and Browns. Should be down to 14 then. Why is that 18? <laughs> oh yeah, Seattle. <laughs> Who am I missing? The fuck? Buccaneers, Browns, Chargers. Now I guess we got to take out the other teams. That's I guess that makes sense. So who was it? Patriots. Falcons. Steelers, right? Let's double check that shit. Yep, Steelers. All right. Save time next time. Let's just make a little extra copy of this over here just take from that so we're down to 14 two more brackets to go everybody's got their name in twice interesting Sp sprouting whatever <laughs> all right so we're doing baby got back and bead it's one through 14 here Let's go for the one seed. And the buy. Just say it. One is Boogie with Stew. Two is Grip Smoke. With One is the Eagles with Stew. Two is Grip Smoke with the Colts. Three is DT with the Bengals. Four is Ticks Broncos. We got Manuel's Bills at five. Joey B at six and seven with both the Jets and Phoenix. Manuel's Vikings. My Saints. Um, the Dolphins. DT's Dolphins at ten. And let's see. My so I got nine and eleven. DT's at ten and three. Manuel's at five and eight. Raiders, Grips Raiders at 12. Tick in the Oilers at 13. And Stu's Bears at 14. All right, let's see what happens. 
Let's just find out, why don't we? 1D14. Here we go. Number 9. The Saints. I'll take it. It's not bad at all. Um, let's see. Oh, don't mess that up. Okay. Enthusiasm. Hey, you know, you always want to win a win a buy if you can. Never hurts. Yep, I don't even know if I'd drop a tear for it. Maybe a, a sigh. All right, Saints got the one seed. Let's take all the camps teams, all two of them off the board. Now one through 12. For the two seed in the bracket. 1D12. Number 11. The Oilers. Tick. Them of the Grogan and Forcade. There they are. Yep, that's back and B for sure. I got a back and B t t team in the uh, in the Saints when I got Mikowski to pair with Flipper. It's it's crazy how the gods just put their stamp on things. They're like, we are here. All right, for the three seed. Let's get rid of Tix teams. One through ten. Number nine, the Raiders. The Raiders, who did they get for their quarterback? Did they get Vinny? I mean, that sounds like a back and B action, action also. Yeah, Vinny. Nice. All right. Now for one of the two teams that is going to play versus my Saints. This is such a back and B fest. I mean, if you had to look, let's take out Grip's team. I don't think the Bears, I don't think they're going to be back and being it at all. Um, let's see. Those Buccaneers would have been perfect in here with Jerry Rice. Um, could be Manuel's Bills. Cause they lost. He lost AC, so you'd think it'd be Manuel's Bills. Um, didn't Phoenix take a, a wide receiver? I feel like they did. Yeah, Willie Galt and quarterback Bills. Yeah, yeah, that's a back and B. That's a total back and B. So, Miami with Sims 
Yeah, I'm saying if it's got to be DT in Miami, or DT's team should be Miami. Stu's team should probably be the Eagles. I don't think the Bears have anything to back and be with. It should be the Bills for Manio, and it should be the Cardinals with quarterback Bills for Joey. All right, let's see what happens. One through eight. Um, who was that just now? The Raiders. Now for the four seed. On the, was it eight? Double check that shit. Number seven, the Dolphins. Yep, that fits. That for show fits. All right, let's see. Okay, so slowly but surely, we're we're calling it. It's landing on the back and B teams. These last three are going to be pretty crucial in proving it. It's already, I mean, that's four for four on back and B teams. That's four for four. So let's look at how many more are left. Are we going to get? And it's going to be pretty close to a 50-50 each, you know, the rest of the way. So Miami's out. Since he's out. One through six. Let's find out. This is for the five seed to play the four seed. And it's down to six. Double check. I just don't want any errors. Yep, six. Okay. Number three. Ooh, this one didn't fit the form. Although, who did the Jets get? Who did the Jets get? They got Barry and the Washington O-line. Yeah, that's not necessarily a back and B team. This, the Cardinals would have been. So that's a miss. That's a miss. That's a definite miss. All right. Now for the six seed. They get the Jets on there? They did not get the Jets on there. Let's get the Jets on there. J E T S Jets Jets Jets. Um, let's see. <laughs> Vengeance. <laughs> Although your Dolphins, man, they, the Dolphins have the uh, Tampa Bay O-line. I think that's that's kind of sketch. I mean, granted, you don't have the 6MS anymore. But, man. Um, okay. For the 6th seed. And i got to get rid of Joey's teams. So, it's either Stu or Manio. And we think it's probably... Buffalo Bills is Manio's back and B team. Didn't Minnesota get somebody too, though? No. They lost Anthony Carter, so they are definitely not a back and B team.
Miami is stacked. Um, let's see. Yeah, this is a pretty heavy hitting uh, bracket so far. For the sixth seed, we're down to four teams. Let's do it. Four. Number two, the Bills. True to form. Well, all right, so the Bills, that's a heavy Bills Raiders. Is that right? Okay, for the seven seed now. The one or the two is going to be Philly or Chicago. It's got to be Philly to be the back and B. Let's see. Got that set, so. Stu, Philly or Chicago. And it's Chicago, not Philly. So five out of seven, which isn't cr isn't crazy. It's pretty good. It got it was touched. You could say it was touched. Baby, this this bracket baby got back and bead for show. That's the fact, Jack. Okay. Okay. easier so all three of those guys one two three four five No, 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 no.
that's seven. So this is the last bracket. There's no magic in this one. But that's okay. He was in the last one, back in B, where he belongs. All right, so I'm sure there will be maybe some back in Bs in this one. I don't know. A couple. This is the final one. And Stu is playing Tix Oilers. <laughs> and Dave Craig don't want to buy. We shall see. So we know who's in the bracket. If you look in the bracket, it's Stu's Eagles, Grips Colts, DT's Bengals, who were much, much unsullied. I mean, just Fulcher and Boomer. Tix Broncos. The Cardinals, quarterback Bills. The Vikings. And the Lions. Oh, let's see who gets it. So if it ends up being Camp, Manio, or Joey. So if it's if it's anything above four, we cannot accept it. Is that correct? Manio, I got one. Joey did. Yep. All the Joes, to be honest. It's crazy. All right, um, let's see. Let me get this stream set up. Oops. Baby got... Man, what a dummy. I know this isn't shocking that I'm a dummy. Okay, Miami-Houston final in that one would be lit. Then you'd be playing Tick again. Okay, for the buy, if the number is above four, it will be a re-roll. So, one seed in blood sugar oh, did we set this up? Yep, one through seven. Let's do it. Number three, the magic number, the bangles. Whew. The Bengals. Did 
They don't need a buy. He's going to need it, says Grip. <laughs> All right, let's get them up in here. We can just eliminate them. Now for the two seed, D6. Number five, the Vikings. All right, for the three seed. Who's it going to be? One through five. Number five, Camp. The Lions. What the fuck, man? What is that all about? Huh. Did I put the lions up there? Just didn't hit. Didn't activate. All right. Um. Now the four seed. Who's gonna play for the right to play DT? Down to four, right? Yep. Number one, the Eagles. That's fucking interesting, man. All right, who are the Eagles going to play? I, uh, the Eagles versus the Cardinals would be pretty fucking epic. And to have a Colts, Colts Broncos one where Broncos used to have, like the, the both are for, forlorn or scorned by Elway moving on. Down to three. Who are the Eagles going to play? For the five seed, it's like the last few rolls. Number two, Tech and the Broncos. Tick, 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 tick. The cards are juice-tastic. So it's either going to be me or Manyo dealing with them. And the other gets Grip and the Colts. So one is Grip, two is Joey B. Who won that just now? Number 
Now for the six seed. Number two. I get Joey B. And the Cardinals. That ought to be interesting. So that means that we are set. The last one is Grips Colts, the number seven seed. And that's our final bracket. So there we go. This bracket. Is good. Is good. This should be fun, man. This is this is awesome. So we're gonna have a double elimination with each each of these brackets. Each team's conditions, injuries, and stats and all that stuff will be kept and at the end of all of the brackets, or the first double elimination brackets, we will have uh, all the stats and teams and conditions merged together and played out on, you know, a couple of, couple of TVs at a time, I'm sure. For, yeah, fuck yeah. All right, well, that was fun. Let's do it again sometime. <laughs> All right, have a good one. Happy Friday almost, half an hour. And, oh, man, in a day and a half, this shit's going to get started. Hot damn.